Hi right, guys, DevonderXYZ, and we're back with more Die Hard Trilogy. On the third game, Die Hard with a Vengeance. And hopefully this will be the last session, because I think there's only about four levels left in the game. So we're getting close to finishing this. Yeah, here I'm at as the dump truck this time. I guess this entire truck has a bomb in it. What the? What am I getting stuck on? Actually, I guess that was a bonus level. <laughs> okay. Down to the last four levels. Yeah, bad start. Oh, uh, why? Why? Okay, tries again. Hitting. God. It's so dark to see. <laughs> yeah. Okay, honestly, it is pretty hard to see. Where, where, where? It's like so far out. <laughs> I don't know how anyone's supposed to get that.
Oh, okay. Man, that took some time. I'm trying to get this truck here. But I had to keep getting time. Oh, great. Hitting it half the time. Oh, my God, I hate this. I hate this. Idea where to go. Okay, not through here, I can tell you that. God, I can't even see half the time, it's so dark. This has got to be the worst level so far.
I was right there. I mean, the only thing that's just guiding me is the, uh, the icons. Any of the icons I see. Oh, come on. I was right there. Again. Aqueduct once again. Oh my god. I, worst level so far. Yeah, because I couldn't see half the stuff on the screen. Keep hitting stuff that I don't mean to. What in the world? Oh, thank God. <laughs> Simon Grubber. Oh. Okay. Both you and your friend are enjoying the game. Actually, I'm kind of surprised they even had Simon here. <laughs> they didn't have Hans. Why not? So, what's my goal here? I got no guns. <laughs> Guess I just land on top of him, I guess. <laughs> yeah, assuming I can actually stay on his tail. Oh god. Wasting more of my time, I can't even reverse. <laughs> oh, this is a fail. Uh I wonder why I can't get my hands on like a uh, 
actual weapon. So close. Missed. Yeah, be another jump pad, right? Somewhere? Maybe? Please? Oh, okay. <laughs> I guess the aqueducts did counter towards the levels. Hooray. <laughs> Mission complete. Interesting boss fight against a helicopter, but <laughs> nonetheless, I mean, it somewhat follows the story, kind of like other games. All right, choose your villains. <laughs> <laughs> Man. Okay. I actually I was kind of more struggling on uh level 10 than anything else. It was just dark as hell. <laughs> Couldn't really see anything. <laughs> actually same same could be said with the last level here, but at the same time at least it was uh at least it it was just a straight up boss fight, so it wasn't that bad. But I mean overall, I uh, Hey, you win. <laughs> you finish all three sections. <laughs> you are a great player. Alright. Please play again. No bonus stuff? Nothing? I guess not. <laughs> yeah, so I guess with Die Hard 3, I think... For the most part, it was it was okay. Uh, it, it, a lot of a lot of collision, a lot of destruction. Kind of reminds me a little bit more, a little bit of burnout in a way. <laughs> I don't know, but at the same time, I kind of find it a little bit frustrating with the controls. Um, well, mainly just trying to reverse. I just had a hard time trying to reverse at all. But I think also just. The collision detection was just pretty bad. It seemed like even though I had like a wide opening, at times I still got stuck on something. And I guess also along that, I kind of wish they would just, I kind of wish they would just increase time limits to getting these bombs, because a lot of them are just really strict. Like you have to be going fast, or like you have to know where the bomb is ahead of time before even attempting it. But but considering you're again you're on a credit system too so 
Unless you just happen to know by chance where the bomb's gonna be. Good luck with that. It's just... It's just gonna be... A pretty tricky game to even complete. Honestly, this entire game itself, all three games were just... Were just, uh... A brutal mess to complete, because, you know... A lot of them either had to... A lot of them just had either, uh... Strict stipulations or stingy on lives or whatever, so... <laughs> Press the any key, all right. Yeah, and I'm sad to say that I had to end up resorting to using cheats through all of this, unfortunately, but, but since this is more just an arcade style game, I think it's just seeing how far you can really reach up with the, reach to uh, complete in each game. But I mean, if you, if you really want to actually complete the game from start to finish, I mean, you kind of have to just rely on the cheats because there's no real, there is no real way. There's like no real way of actually uh, making it, uh, you know, finishing the game itself. So, I mean, at least I can cross this off my bucket list, to say the least. But honestly, I'd still prefer Die Hard Trilogy 2. Because it takes the same control schemes from this game, but it applies it more fair and more balanced ish. <laughs> Got that. I think that has some kind of harsh moments there as well but you know at least it was more balanced and at least it has a an original story on top of that maybe not one of the best stories but at least it was an original story <laughs> so uh honestly with that i i guess there you have it die hard trilogy you either love it or you hate it <laughs> i don't really think there's really any in between through any of this sad to say <laughs> But who knows, I'm pretty sure you could find like a cheap copy on this on eBay like I did for like five bucks. <laughs> if you really want to go for it. But in my honest opinion, I'd still say stick with Trilogy 2. It's probably the better game. Alright guys, this is Double Hunter XYZ, and until next time.